Oh, hello. I did not see you there. <laughs> That's my husband's line in case anyone didn't know that. Hello, 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 everybody. Welcome to the channel. My name is Lindsay, and this is Life with Lindsay. <sighs> Today, we have, I have a long awaited art haul. Um, and when I mean long awaited, like both of these packages showed up last year, I just didn't have the time <coughs> to do anything with them. I, I didn't know where to put them, so we're going to do them today. Um, I am not in my usual angle when I film front facing because the camera is, well, right here. Hi. Um, but normally it's further back, but if I have art, I want to show you guys. So, oh, I just stabbed myself in my chin. This is going swimmingly well if you're new here hi welcome my name is Lindsay. i do mainly diamond painting and other crafting related content i would love for you to like subscribe hit the bell hop aboard the hot mess express let's be friends if you've been here before hi welcome back so i've got two artist stuff um yes so i'm gonna just undo some of the tape i have a fragile handle with care sticker on this one so i'm just gonna shimmy on through it how are you guys doing um i realize that it looks like i'm not wearing anything i'm just wearing like a little white <coughs> camisole i promise you i am definitely wearing something um i put up a video on instagram my one girlfriend messaged me like private messaged me and she's like are you naked and i was like what no i'm not posting videos of me naked on the internet i was in a towel but you can only see the top of the towel i guess she didn't notice so this is from Curtis Reykjavik. Is it Reykjavik or Reykjavik? It's Reykjavik, right? I say this every single time and I never know. Um, so I'm going to show you guys. This is how it was shipped. Um, if you purchase with him, uh, for whatever it is, prints, keychains, zip bags, whatever it may be, uh, it always states on his website what his turnaround time is because it does vary. Um, ooh. I'm hoping there's no there's no shipping label. So I'm gonna pause you guys real quick so that I can double check the names of what I've got and I'll be right back. So I do have the names. Uh, if you guys don't know any of Curtis Reykjavich's art or you don't think you do, uh, Dreamer Designs now sells his artwork, some of his artwork. The Simon Paintings, I have Hazel, um, which I believe I did an unboxing for. If I did, I'll leave that up in the eye. I've got a couple. Um, I don't love how Dreamer Designs renders. So, um, speaking of Hazel, I got this cutie patootie right here. This is her sticker. This is a three-inch sticker. I love this. Um, I have no idea, like, what I need it for, but... But I needed it. Obviously. Okay. So I've got... Uh, this is Claudia. I am just making sure I'm not butchering things here. Okay, so this is a keychain. I'll show you guys what it comes... How it comes packaged. I'm probably going to get a bounce back from the ring light. So it comes... There is a Wicked Damsels uh, business card. I will leave all the information down below. But here is the keychain. Oh my god, you guys, this is so freaking cute. Look at her. I love this one. Hey, Dreamer Designs, make this one. Um, these are nice, too. These are decently thick. Um, she's got her cute little teddy bear and her bat. And then the keychain itself has charms of stars and moons. I love this stuff. And then it has one of the good... I don't know why I gave you a Popeye face. Like, what are these kinds of clasps? Uh, my sister's probably yelling at me right now because my sister sells jewelry. And she's probably like, that's called the blah, blah, blah clasp. And I'm like, there's a clasp on it, you guys. Um, don't mind me. Okay. And then, you know, I knew there was a reason I wanted to open this last year and I forgot. So here's Alice. Uh, Dreamer Designs has this one. I have this one. And, um, these are earrings. They're gorgeous. Ugh. 
sorry, it's not very often that I'm like totally stunned and speechless. Um, I am almost never speechless, so you know what? I'm not going to even try to finagle this one back in. We're not going to worry about it. Okay. Oh no. Where'd we go? This last one here is a wood print hand embellished, and this one is going to be Bianca. Um, I have been gifted some of his uh, prints, and Miranda got me one in a frame, but I think it's, an, is it oil? I can't remember what the material. Guys, I am, listen, I like art. I know nothing about it. Oddly enough, my mother's an artist. My sister's an artist. I am not. Hi. My husband's an artist. That was him in the background, if you guys didn't know. My husband is super talented. Like, far more talented than I'll ever be. But he also wouldn't try diamond painting, so, you know. He probably would if I was like, I need you to do this. Okay. Let's have this moment together. Ooh, it's... Oh my god, it has been... Uh, when did this say it was delivered? October, you guys. <laughs> October. I am filming this in February. I'm literally the worst. Um, and I can still smell like the wood. So we're going to look at this together. Okay. Okay. Listen. She is not that big. So she is nice to go on the wall. Does it say how big she is? No. Why do you have a tape measure if that's important? I don't know. Is that important? Look at this. Oh my god. With the glitter. First of all, silver is my favorite color. Looks about uh, four by seven. Okay, we'll call that. Um, but like, here's her little black cat and her phone. Her like silver pumpkin. Sorry, I keep looking at it. She's beautiful. Oh my god. This is definitely going to be hung up. Actually, I don't know if it'll be hung up or if I'll put it, because it is like really thick. Um, yeah. This could just sit on its own on a shelf. So, you guys. Okay. Um, so, next time I say I'm going to do an art haul, just don't take me too seriously. You guys. <laughs> Clearly that's been sitting there for a really long time. All right. The next package we've got is from Simona Candini. If you guys know anything about me uh you know simona is my jam first of all she does a ton of alice images um i wept like actual tears when i did the unboxing for alice in the sea of tears i will leave that up in the eye for you guys um so i spent my monies and i got myself a hand embellished print from her and um I think I unboxed that on this channel, too. Maybe I did that on my Instagram. Did. did I do it on YouTube? If it's on YouTube, I'll link it up here. If it's on Instagram, I'll put it in the description box. I don't know. Let's... So, if you order from Simona, she has an Etsy shop. She... If you are getting anything that is hand embellished, that will come directly from her overseas in Italy. And I... I shit you not. I ordered it, and it was here the next day. Like, it takes longer for things in the U.S. to get to me than it did for that package to get to me. I don't know what kind of magic she worked. However, if you are ordering something and it does not require hand embellishment from Simona, uh, it ships out of Washington State. So, I got these prints a while back. I wonder if I should even look at the... I think I got these in December. Guys, I'm literally the worst. Um, well, oh, here we go. Delivered 12 7 2021. So, all right, she was having a sale. I bought two of her prints and then I got two prints for free. There's buy one, get one. Um, so I'm going to show you guys what I got. Um, if you're not into watching people cry over art, then you can probably tune out now because I can. Almost guarantee you that that is what is going to happen. I just want to show you guys. This was mailed. It Please do not bend. A thick cardboard envelope on the inside. It has the prints in between two pieces of cardboard as well. Um, I 
I'm so excited, you guys. I think you can see it already. So, uh, here is the art of Simona Candini. That is Alice in the White Rabbit House. If you would like to purchase this canvas, Diamond Art Club has it. If you would like to see the unboxing of this, done by the Data Monster himself, I will link that for you guys. Um, I love this image. And then the little thank you. Sorry, I know, like, I'm just trying to make sure I have the information here. Okay. So, I don't know what this one, Leona, if you're watching, you are going to freaking love this. Um, with the tattoos, can you guys see this? I'm trying to, like, block my face out so it, look at the tattoos here. Uh, gorgeous. And then all the butterflies coming out of the book. And the half face half skeleton, you guys, um, okay, <laughs> I'm just trying to prepare myself, because I already know, I just want to take a moment before I open this, I know you guys are like, get to the art, um, if it were not for diamond painting, I would never have discovered Simona Candini, I more than likely would never have discovered Simona Candini, um, Doing diamond painting has opened up an entire world of art and artists to myself that I did not know that I liked or anything along those lines. So, I just want to put that out there. And this is numbered 23 out of 50. It does have her signature on the back. I will put the names if I can find them up on the screen, but this is definitely an Alice in Wonderland image. Diamond Art Club, please, please put this on. License this one um, with the flamingo. Um, what size would you call this print? Do you know? Looks like an eight and a half by eleven. Yeah, somewhere in that range. That seems right. Okay. Maybe nine by twelve. It, it was a little slightly off because they had to cut it, so you can have room for matting. Whatever it is. It's not a super small print or anything like that. Um, I love, I love it. Um, with the little gingerbread mat. Look, I don't even celebrate Christmas. Look how freaking cute she is. All of her girls have so much sadness in their face. I'm sorry. Um, look how cute this is. I can't even... I, this one is also numbered. This is numbered 13 out of 50 with her signature on the back. Um, 13 is my lucky number. Uh, I'm going to stop crying. I'm not going to stop crying. Um, it's a really great deal. Um, okay, let's see. This one is numbered 28 out of 50. Where are we? Oh, yeah. Okay. So, she does a lot of these in, like, the pastel colors, but I... Okay, look. <laughs> I don't know. In the words of Mrs. Coffee, look, listen. Look at this, guys. She's so cute. She's so beautiful. With her pink hair. Spoiler alert. I want pink hair. I've wanted pink hair for over a decade. Uh, probably two decades. Um, then you, she got her little tattoos. This is gorgeous. Again, also signed on the back. Um, these are gorgeous prints, you guys. This one is numbered 10 out of 50. So, she's got a lot in this, like, pastel style. She has a lot of, like, pastel goth. But she also has some, like, really cutesy. I mean, I would call this cutesy. But, I mean, not everybody is going to be, like, all about... These are, like, the gears, the, uh, oh my god, yeah, and then you can see, like, the cyborg eye, but then look at this little, like, flying kitty with a ball of yarn, holy crap, Briar, do not see this, because she's gonna want it, and then there's some, another flying kitty with yarn down here, playing the violin, I don't know, <laughs> I don't know what it is, you guys, I don't know what it is, I am, I love I love her artwork. And I'm not going to sit here and like stare at it off camera myself 
too much because then you guys are gonna be like, nobody wants to see you looking at what we can't see. Um, so I got all of her prints from her Etsy shop. As I said, if you are not getting anything hand embellished, she just has them shipped to you from uh, her, I guess, business partner in Washington, um, Washington State. So it's a lot easier if you are uh, US based than to pay for shipping from Europe. Um, that's it. That's all I got. Uh, next time I do an art haul, and I feel like there's something else art related that I'm totally forgetting that was downstairs somewhere. Eventually I'll find it. But I didn't want to do just a haul with one artist stuff and then you guys be like, oh cool, you showed like one print and a keychain or, you know, one print or two prints. So I did want to wait for it to come, which is why I'm going to justify it in my head that I waited till at least a couple months after I got the first package. We're not going to try to justify this. That's it. That's it. That's all I got for you guys. Again, uh, we got all the beauties from Curtis. I think I might just put her right here on the shelf. She's gorgeous. She'll fit there. Yeah, oh yeah, she'll fit there. Um, but that's it. I hope that you guys enjoyed this. I know this is not my typical unboxing, but look, I love art. Hopefully you love art. Um, and hopefully you got to see some stuff today that you have never seen or that interested you. If you like this video and you'd like to see more content like this or, you know, nothing like this at all, please make sure to give this video two thumbs up real life one virtual make sure you hit that subscribe button come join the sparkle squad and while you're there hit that notification bell Dang. i do not operate on any sort of schedule i operate on toddler standard time and i record when my tiny human is sleeping or sleeping thank you guys so much for being here and i'll see you in my next one bye guys